So, well, our day started off, to be honest, since we're on an honest level, um, getting out the Covenant House. Living, the living quarters is just like prison. It's just like, got the prison showers, Fucking toilets, and you get, you got a stand record, you have a curfew. Okay, so let's, let's just get real honest with this shit. Okay, so first of all, I've been traveling around from Covenant House to Covenant House because when I was 17, I left my mother's house and I flew to Los Angeles and joined the Sea Org and became deep inside Scientology. Scientology declared me a suppressive and kicked me out of the church and I was homeless on the streets of Los Angeles. I got my feet up on Los Angeles, I started to sell cocaine, I got a lot of money, I decided to travel across the country. And then I flew to Houston because one day I was like, fuck it, fuck stability, fuck sitting in one spot and getting a, a fucking wife and getting a house and all that bullshit. I'm gonna go travel the world. Hey, I'm serious about this, I'm passionate. I'm glad somebody can fucking videotape me because my story needs to be heard. I came down to New Orleans, I got off New Orleans and came to the New Orleans Covenant House. So me and my friend here were putting up with being at the Covenant House. I was there putting up with for being two weeks. He was there putting up being like what? Um, seven to eight months, but <laughs> seven to eight months. But I mean, this guy just gets out of jail and then comes to the Covenant House. Prison, prison, che prison, prison. Checks in, and then an hour later checks back out. And we say, "Fuck this, man! We're gonna go live in the streets." We're gonna go live in the streets, we're gonna make art, we're gonna see people, we're gonna live it up like an 18 year old should fucking do. You know, being big in astrology like I am, I read my zodiac. It tells me I'm gonna find a person who's gonna look up to me as if I'm his mentor. Me and this person are gonna, gonna go out and our lives are gonna change. We met each other at, at a point in our lives where we both needed each other, what we didn't have in each other. And, that's what it is. And We're it kind of all connected too because in astrology speaking, we all combine to make each other feel like whatever he's losing, I'm gaining from him. Whatever I'm losing, he's gaining from me. It's a complete synchronistic balance that we that we have uh, come about. We skip all the distractions and we head straight to compassion. That's what we do. You know, not only are we changing our lives, but we're changing the lives of others. And, and it just feels great, it really does. Um, we're homeless at the moment, honestly, but we don't see it as that because being homeless is more of a mentality rather than something that, that you should dwell on, you know? And we're, eight, we're all 18 and we've been homeless for a while now and we try to make the best of it, you know? We try to show people that it's not all what it really seems like, you know? Home is where the heart is. Right, we look out for each other. We're a family. When I met these people, I was like, yeah, I'm finally home. I have a place to stay now.